What's going on everyone, it's Greg back with some more Mirror 4 and while we do not have our patch notes yet, we do have some information on our 100 day anniversary um, event. And so this is something that is coming from Korea. They do actually, they have actually had this every 100 days so that the 100, 200, 300 and they haven't hit 400 yet, but they just had their one year anniversary, which I think may include the same stuff, I'm not 100% sure. Um, or if they just had it at the 300, I'm not. I'm not too sure how it's gonna flow after the 300th day, but I do know we get another event at the one year anniversary. So let's just go ahead and get right into. It. I want to try to make this pretty quick and go through and answer, maybe hopefully answer some questions that you guys may have. First and foremost, we got the Joy of Growth event. Now this page right here has each event listed, and then there's a details page. So we're gonna flip back and forth. So on this, it's a 14 day um, calendar reward type thing. You will get our divine dragon's blessing and happiness of upgrade gift box. So let's flip over to what that looks like. So as you can see here, um, the events are pretty much 14 days with I guess some extension if like maybe someone missed a day or two of logging in. But essentially what's gonna happen is on your first day through your six and then eight through 13, you're gonna get the happiness of upgrades gift box. On day 7, you're going to get a special gift box, Happiness of Upgrade. And then on 14, we're going to get our single Divine Dragon's Blessing. So, the Happiness of Upgrade gift box is going to include um, a rare Enhancement Stone, two rare Advancement Cordials, and two 30-minute Vigor Pills. And then on that one on that day 7, we're going to get an Epic Advancement uh, Stone. <laughs> I'm assuming that's what... Wait, what is it? Epic Advancement Drought? I'm assuming there's a translation issue there. Um, or I'm just un not understanding what that is. Uh, maybe it's the, like the, oh, I think these are the little bottles that last three hours. The little bottles that last three hours. I think that's what this is. So, epic advancement, uh, one of those bottles. A rare mystic enhancement stone. That's nice. And two vigor pills of 60 minutes. So, we're going to get one of those while uh, the event is going on. And then on day 14, we'll get the dragon's blessing. We'll get to what that does in a minute. So, the next thing is our divine dragon's blessing. That's what they're gonna we're gonna use that for. And again, you so you'll be able to get one divine dragon's blessing during the event. And then um, if you do not take care of it, it is going to be deleted by the end of the event. You can summon one of Dragon Horn, Dragon Leather, Dragon Scale, Spirit Stone, Skill Tomb with the highest grade that you failed to combine before. Only characters having failed attempts on Dragon Scale, Dragon Leather, Dragon Horn. Skill Tomb and Spirit Stone until the end of the start of the event, which by the time you're watching this, it's going to be too late. Um, so you would have to have done this before this video came out. Essentially what this means, you would have had to fail um, in upgrades. Like, so let's just go with what most people are going to have, which is the rare. So most people have tried to combine rare Dragon Horns, Leather, Scale, Spirit Stone, Skill Tombs. As long as you have one of those that failed, you can purchase that or you can get that summon from this event you can only get one out of they're gonna have like all five up there so you're gonna be able to pick one for this event so let's go ahead and talk about that a little bit more on the details page um i'm just gonna skim through this i'm gonna go through everything but just I, what i really want to make sure you guys are clear on is that this is based on the combination so it's essentially a retry for a failed combination so most people again are gonna have unless you're like wailed out most people have only combined up to the rare so you combine four rare spirits for dragon skills, for leathers, for horns, or for skill books. Skill books is probably the one that a lot of people aren't going to have either. Um, I at this point have combined four skill books, but again, most people might probably end up going for the spirit anyway. Um, me personally, I think I'm going to go for the dragon leather because I really need a leather and it has a little bit higher chance. The chance on getting the epic item, because this is what happens, you're only able to go up to the rare because that's what you combined and failed on. So when you get this thing, it's a basically a retry on the combination. So you can either get the rare or the epic. Now, if you're one of the whales or someone who's got really lucky, maybe you combined four epic spirits before. If you've done that, then you'll get you'll be able to get the box that is legendary, which means you'll get a, either an epic or a legendary. But most people are going to be at the rare or epic level or less. I think you will at least get a rare if you even if you haven't combined anything yet. I'm not sure. Um. So if you're at that level, what's going to happen is you. Uh, for like spirit I think and skills I believe it's both spirits and skills you'll have a 7% chance to get an epic or 93% chance to get a rare and then on the scales leather and horn it should be 10% and 
So that's how that's going to work. It's essentially a single retry on one of your failed combinations is what it equates to. But it's not I don't think it's going to make the instance burner go up. So don't depend on that. Um, you still your instance burner is going to stay the same. As far as I know. Anyway, that is explained on this page. You can see these details on the uh, forum. Uh, this does kind of this is basically what I just explained. So, you know, when you use the box, that's what's going to happen. You can only get one box from a thing, and it's going to be on day 14 of the other event where you because you have to basically log in for 14 days to be able to get the ticket for this. So that covers the Divine Dragon's Blessing. Next, we have the Joy of Gathering. So this is going to be kind of similar to the drums that we were just collected for siege that's the easiest thing for me to compare it to you can basically obtain dragon fruit in the same manner uh, you get the fight mods within 20 levels um, so they're gonna have a fruit exchange shop and then a golden dragon fruit exchange shop this is where your pay to win aspect you're gonna need to put some money in if you want to get everything off the golden dragon shop so let's go ahead and go over to that event and get the details joy of gathering here we go same event period 14 days the joyful happiness dragon fruit exchange shop. Dragon fruit can be earned by hunting during this period. You gotta do within 20 level difference mobs. So you, the mobs have to be within 20 levels. Um, now for that 20 level, like I believe I ended up leveling up on one of my uh, one of my alts on when I was doing the drums, and I was 45 fighting level 25 mobs. And once I hit, well, I was 44. And once I hit 45, those 20 level 25 mobs stopped. Um, dropping the drums so keep that in mind you can get up to 500 dragon fruit per day now if the drop rate is similar to the drums it means you're gonna have to do quite a bit of afk grinding which most people who are xp will do that anyway but just keep that in mind it might take a little bit longer to get these we'll have to wait and see and then um, you have to visit the NPC in the castle snake pit or spiritual center to exchange them now these are the items that are exchangeable with the dragon fruit that will be dropping now keep in mind you get a maximum of 14,000 should be able to get all of the good stuff which is basically anything from here and above i think it comes up to like 7500 or something like that so you get a divine dragon's gift box epic blue dragon statue you get up to five of those you get three rare blue dragon statues or oh, three per day um so keep that in mind some of these are per day i mean to me that's glittering powder right there i probably want to try to make sure we get those Make sure you spend your points wisely um, each day because you want to be able to get the daily things and make sure you, you probably want to calculate this ahead of time to see what all you want to get. Um, then you got Mystic Magic Square Box. You're only going to be able to get one of those. Secret Peak, same thing. I'm assuming these are going to be the same as the boxes from the um, shop that you get for mileage. At that case, you can get up for anywhere from one to five tickets out of it. Epic Mystic Enhancement Stone. Um, that's, a, that's, the, that's the red one. That's good. One per character. A rare Mystic Enhancement Stone, you get up to three of those. Then you got the other little small things here to kind of use up the rest of your um, Dragon Fruit. Now, the pay to win aspect is uh, well, you get this, we'll get one of these Divine Dragons gift box from this, and you'll get 10 of the Golden Dragon Fruit. Then you'll get one of each ticket, and then this Mystic Dragon Material Summon box. Um, the Golden Dragon Fruit is what you use for these items here on this shop. That's going to be, um, you can get basically these codex items, but you only got 10 of these rare dragon fruit. So you could choose to just go ahead and go for the one, which will give you drop chance plus two, uh, 2%. Um, otherwise, you're going to have to spend some money to get the rest of these and fill in the accuracy, crit, crit evade, and uh, hunting XP. Now, of course, these are all time limited. These will be gone on December 27th. Otherwise, you can use your uh, points to get some bigger or speed up tickets or the the blessings for the XP. So that covers the um, Joy of Gathering. And the last two things we got going on pretty quick and easy here, Hoppy's Arcadia Express, and then we got Surprise Up and Down. These are both on details on this other uh, tab I got open here. Let me just let me just jump into that, it'd be easier to just cover it. So for the Arcadia Express, you need to check your mailbox. Uh, mails that contain gifts, special gifts will be sent the third through uh during december 3rd sent to you three times from december i guess there's just different times gonna be sent anyway it's gonna end up in your mail from i guess the third to the fourth it looks like um i guess if you're on na they'll start coming in on the second um so anyway we're gonna end up getting three different mails for some special gifts we do not have the details on this gifts here um we'll have to get them claimed before uh 
they end the date on December 24th. So make sure you log in and get those. So, oh, wait, not 24th. I'm sorry. If I say 24th, I apologize. It's December 4th. Then, the uh, last but not least, surprise up and down. This is going to have, this is something that where if you didn't pay attention to the but stuff that was posted before uh, the servers went down today, um, basically, you probably spent too much copper on your summons today. These are going to be all these summons the Dragon Material, Spirit Stone, and Skill Tomb tickets 1, 2, and 3, which are normally 60, 120, and 240k copper, are only going to be 100 copper during the event. So, 900 copper will get you all of the summons during this event. So, 14 days that's beautiful, absolutely wonderful. I, I'm you know, that's great. We're all going to save a lot of copper during this time period. And then, also, if you are spending some money. You will get a, a double mileage on any gold spent and that covers the event this is the event that's going on we're going to do a separate video on the patch notes and go over the changes coming to the game other than that i do want to cover the event in a separate video because i think some people may be searching for some information on this so thank you guys for all the support thanks for watching the video if you're enjoying the content please hit that like button and as usual guys i'll catch you in the next video